Me, Pink Wolfie. And Ian. And today we're playing Octodad. Or, well, more like he's playing Octodad, I'm watching. I get to have the controller this time. <laughs> Someone feel all big and bad. Maybe. <laughs> so. I've played the entirety of this game, but he's never actually tried it. All I know is the controls are going to be terrible. This is going to be so much fun to watch. Like Mr. Groom, the wedding is starting. Are you ready? <laughs> What's that hairspray gonna do? Or is that just like air freshener? I guess he would probably want to cover that smell. Hey, I'm dressed. <laughs> just I don't wear a suit. Okay, what are we doing here? Well, right now you're wiggling an arm. Like nobody's business. Okay, cool. You use the bumper. Woo! I guess you can use A as well. Okay, cool. Who locks these things? People who want to focus on octopus. Oh, okay. <laughs> Look what, you, look what you did! You're destroying this poor place! <laughs> oh god! <laughs> there you go! <laughs> All I can think of is uh, Hank from Finding Dory. Although honestly, he's a much better octopus than you are right now. Yeah, Hank was a pro. I. Dance party! <laughs> Is this the dance party button? Yeah. Oh my god, it is! <laughs> <laughs> Good job. Ooh, you should not go for the cake. But it was probably like 10 grand. So? And it's my cake. It's your cake, you can do what you want with it. I wanna, I wanna touch my wife. Oh god, honey! <laughs> <laughs> I got you! You're saved! <laughs> I'm just gonna put you back on the cake. I would have offered her a chair, honestly. Oh, that's a good idea. Oh. The figurine is him. Like, how did the person making that not notice? <laughs> okay. You just, you guys. <laughs> just lovingly knock her over. Just throw her upside. See how it is. Look, 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 there's a thing there. Right there in the middle. Yes, that's flowers. <laughs> okay, this isn't so bad. I just wanted you to find at least one thing. <laughs> well, you better go find the rest of your clothes. You're supposed to be getting married. Oh, yeah. What, what does that say? Dressing room. Alright. Wait, what? Ah. Did you pick up a balloon? Probably. Open! <laughs> he can't open things outward. Oh yeah. You got a key. What is this open? I think it's the other door. Did you drop the key? Oh no, okay. Good. I was gonna say that's gonna be a pain in the butt to find him. I'm not even grabbing things, they're just going flying near me. Okay. Now, what? Go back this way. Nope. I wanna close the door! <laughs> you alright, Bob? You gave me the weirdest, like, half tooth, like, snarl. Yeah, it sounds like you can go through that door. But uh, I want to leave. I, I have cold feet. <laughs> You're an octopus, of course you have cold feet. Wait, do I have feet? Technically, you're using tentacles as feet, so yes. Ugh. Ooh, it's That's dusty. Are you going to go force people to sign that for you? <laughs> Is that Cthulhu? <laughs> <laughs> I like this church. <laughs> or you could just kick it. 
Let's go put your bow tie on. Oh, I, I wanted to leave. Oh, hey, bow tie. There you go. I'm hoping no one gave you anything breakable. Is it nom, 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 nom. Babies. <laughs> I hope it's not babies. <laughs> Who designed this building? What's wrong with these doorknobs? Well, it's the Trojan Cthulhu. Event this way. Event that way. Okay. How did you get a doorknob all the way in the hallway? I am a throwing pro. <laughs> Need some flowers for the for the wife. Okay. Fair enough. Oh, a dick. sorry, I couldn't see. <laughs> you just said, "Oh, a dick." Oh, you should put that top hat on. That was not well made. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> That's the most amazing way to put on a hat. Okay, so you want to be careful because if you knock off. Over too much stuff, everyone gets suspicious of you. Your family members just a fish. Like well, I couldn't knock over too much more. I'm stuck. No, oh, there you go. Oh God! <laughs> you just threw your uncle. That. I think that was. A piranha or something carnivorous. No, I did get cold feet. It just wouldn't let me leave. Guess you'll have to get the ring yourself. That looks shiny. Those coins? This is like a whole chest of just gems. That's a kraken coin. Oh, there's the ring. If you can move it a little bit. Coin. There you go. That ring is like bigger than her entire hand. <laughs> Stop abusing your wife. Abuse. <laughs> Shoved it into her palm. It was like a bracelet. His neck is so creepy. It's not even a neck, it's just legs. I know. It's just so creepy. Okay. Oh, I guess we gotta flash forward for me to be Octo Dad. Yeah. I don't know, you can control him with it. Whee! Okay, with the blue suit, all I'm picturing is the doctor, but as an octopus. The entire day. I wanna go through the O. Oh, I completely missed. Oh, you can help me? Yeah, you're cute. Go ahead. Go ahead. Go ahead. Go ahead. Go I can fly! Oh god, I kicked myself in the face. <laughs> Good job. Excuse me, that was a weird hit. Did I go to heaven? Hmm. Also, how am I having children with this woman? It's simple. You took off the uh, tentacle that represented the, uh, you know, thing, and presented it to her as a present. So that she can impregnate herself as what she wished. Oh, it's a good arrangement, I guess. Well, there's one way to get out of bed. <laughs> What's it 2 a.m.? 2 p.m. Ah. Uh, 
Because if so, what are you doing at waking up at 2 p.m.? Either way, really. Yeah. Are you just gonna destroy everything in this room? Not that. I love my family. <laughs> no, look at you. I am a responsible Octo Dad. Yes, clearly. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, you didn't want to look at your family anymore? That wasn't as pretty as the other family. Could you imagine if his wife just deal with this every day? He wakes up, destroys everything in the room, and then comes out. And it's like, okay, what do I have to put back up now? I don't even take the mattress. Okay, I am satisfied. Also stuck. <laughs> <laughs> nope, that is not up. Shit. <laughs> <laughs> you never get the story thing. President Doctor Dad. <laughs> you just drop that on your head. Here you go, child. Yes, just take her eye out. <laughs> An off-handed explanation, though. Hey! This is the wedding cake topper that you threw. Bye! <laughs> Make some coffee, oh god. I'm stuck. <laughs> Stop grabbing stuff. I didn't grab it. <laughs> Let go. Oh, there's a coffee. Where's the leg I can control? You know, Sherry from the book club. I caught her the other day eating a whole wedding cake. And nobody was getting married. This Maybe she just wanted cake. You are making such a mess. <laughs> This could not have gone worse. <laughs> there you go. I made the thing happen. Honey, clean up on aisle everywhere. There you go, good job. Do I do I not need water for this? Apparently not. Milk jug. I know where the milk is. Yes, in the oven. What is that? Corn? No, it's a fish. Honey, I, I found the fish. <laughs> How did you hurt her with the fish? <laughs> Wait, what are we trying? I don't know. <laughs> the table. Stop, I'm married. <laughs> Let go of me! I think we have an issue one night stand. I made it. Good job. That was a terrible joke at one point. Speaking of night stand, I thought of the kitchen tables. Fitting. I heard some crashing from the living room, mister. You know I just cleaned it last night. Thank you, Nelson. I'm doing very well for destroying everything. Yeah. I made your coffee just the way you like it. Sea salt and tartar sauce. And that doesn't seem weird to you. How do I do the drink key? Uh, you just bring it to your mouth. There you go. Thank you. You are a wonderful wife. Okay. <laughs> 
And he breaks that 15 minute mark. Oh. <laughs> I don't think you're just spinning. <laughs> <laughs> just wee! Alright guys, we're definitely going to play some more of this, and we'll see you next time. Yep. Bye.